wildlife and an old western. It looks like old western. Oh, we have to go back in time, Tony. I think we have to go back in time. Wait, Holy we go shit. back in time and build a teleporter. Okay, hold on. Wait, think about this. If we build a teleporter in Cerberus, go back in time to our ancestors, maybe our ancestors can find the way. Yes, this all makes sense now. Do you think you can have it done by Monday? What the? What, what do you think I am, Tony? I can get it done by a Saturday. Man? A Saturday. <laughs> nah, I'm just fucking with you. Listen, uh, where are you I at? I don't know if I can time travel on Saturday. Where are you at? I'm at the bank. Are you swim all the way back that fast? No, I used to teleporting. Tony, how dare you? What? Head back to the city and come in. Let's meet up. Come pick me up. Uh, I'll come pick you up. I'll be this one. Bye-bye. Wait. Where are you at? I'm in the city. Oh, my God. All right. I'll be on the bench. I'll be sitting here in front of the Polito Bank. I'll see you soon. All right. We're sitting here. Is this, is this Hurry, call? please. All right. Yeah, I'm coming right now. Bye bye. Love you. All right, bang. Love you. Guys, if I were you guys, I wouldn't tow that car. Hey, I'm fucking with that shit. Let's just keep it moving. Yeah. Hello? Shit. I'll let you in. Go ahead. Thank you, sir. Yes. Yeah, I would let Lang eat my ass out, no problem, bro. Any mm, day of the week. Bellagio. True. <laughs> All right, let me ask you a question. Okay. You know what's a, you know about what the box is inside the box? Do I know about what the... What do you mean? What's inside that box? 12 inch pizza, 13 inch. Yeah, you know about pizza? it? I'll open the box. Okay. Okay. Ketamine. We have an issue. Okay. Randy. Yeah? You want to tell him the issue? About oh, yeah, where his name is brought in? Listen, man. Big fuck ups happening in this world, right? Society is turning upside down. Okay, Randy, Your he name... doesn't need a fucking goddamn story <laughs> behind it. All right, man. Long story short, you know what, Ursula? Ah, uh, yes. Apparently, she's snitching on you to Wrangler about the ketamine with Chatterbox and uh, what's his name, Kirk Jerkums. What does that even mean? I actually used your name. So it there's three people directly working with Wrangler to take down the ketamine production. Yeah, they're trying to figure out how ketamine is getting out on the streets. And everyone knows it comes through the prison. And Ursula's working with Chad Bait or Chad Box and uh, Kirk Jack. <laughs> Kirk Jackins to, uh, to, like, you know, stop yeah, the whole I don't, operation. I don't sell this shit. And they so dropped why, the name, bro. So they dropped. The problem is the guy that, I guess, handles this operation told Randy, they're directly talking with Wrangler. I guess their snitch, the snitches are talking with Wrangler and they brought your name into it. Yeah. Uh, who who told him this? The guy, uh, his name is Roman. You know Roman? Roman. Yeah. Yeah, this guy called, I, I'm starting to understand, I'm starting to get what's going on here. Now this guy speaking? calls okay. me about a week ago. Yeah. Uh, to ask me my opinion of uh, who my boys Oh, fuck it. You know, Mickey and uh, Ray yeah. will help yeah. him with the ketamine. He, he wanted my opinion on uh, how to get them to work better together. Now that I'm thinking of I think he's trying to set me up as his fall guy. Oh, shit. So, I, think so. I never thought it, it really didn't make any sense as to why he was coming to me and trusting me and giving me all this information and trying to really badly to get me to work with him. Oh. Hmm. Oh, here's your pizza bag, by the way. Fucking hell, man. So I think so he's now, trying to set me up as his fall guy. So the issue we're having is 
Okay, so Ursula is my manager at Moldini's. And I don't want nothing to come back to us. Now, if you're involved with this, do you have anybody that can maybe get rid of it for me? Oh, I'll get like, rid so of it for you. Like nothing comes back to us. And once we get like concrete proof. Yeah, I could eat. I'll do that myself. I would love to kill that woman. Oh, right, shit. Because if she's talking, bro, because God knows the shit she hears from our conversations in Moldini's up in my office or in the fucking in the basement, bro, with the boys, it's probably not good for all of us. Yeah, I would be very careful. Uh, I know that uh, that's his ex-wife or some shit. Yeah, that's a random yeah, yeah, said. Yeah, they used to fucking like, uh, you know what he told me? They used to go on Discord calls and saw Okay, Randy, shut the fuck up. <laughs> he, he did say that, actually. He actually did. Now, the weird thing is, is uh, Chatterbox also called me like three days ago, giving me all this info, saying he wants to take down Roman. So now they're working together? No, yeah. no. Roman is saying that Chatterbox and uh, Kurt Jerkums and us are working together with working Wrangler. With Wrangler. To stop this whole operation. And apparently they dropped Roman's name as well. They snitched on him too, apparently. I think Roman's trying to make me the fall guy, if I'm being honest. I think he's intentionally spreading all this information. Yeah. Uh, this is just so fucking weird. I'm going to kill this motherfucker. Yeah. This you is like Roman as well. Fucked. Let's kill all of them. Now, the thing is, do we trust Roman or do we just kill them all? I would kill them all because uh, if Roman is not setting me up to be a fall guy, he is insanely loose-lipped. Now, Randy, tell Buddha about what this guy said, how he has Wrangler wrapped around his finger. Yeah, he told but me that already. He uh, wants to like stash a bunch of ketamine in his uh, in one of his houses or some shit. Did you guys hear about that? Yeah, he did say that actually. He also said that he was pretending to Wrangler that he he knows the guy who you know runs operation when he was the guy. So he was trying to figure out like what kind of tactics Wrangler was using to stop the operation. So he pretending like he was gonna set up the actual guy. But he was the actual guy, if that makes sense. You get what I'm saying or not? And he like yeah, he yeah, basically yeah. told Wrangler to throw him in for like a 48 hour hold while yeah, that, he was just doing it to get the stuff out. Yeah, but I don't think he was doing it to get the stuff out. I think he was doing it to start setting people up. I think that's why he's been calling me like crazy. You know, so when shit gets subpoenaed, they can they can see that we've been in some sort of contact. I think he's trying to fucking set me up as a fall guy. If I'm being honest. Oh shit, bro! You have like logs with him. You called him. Oh, he's called me. I'll see you in for the nines, brother. Yeah, it might be uh, my time soon here, boys. Well, I guess it has to be like back in the day, like with no loose ends again, huh? Yeah, so Ursula, Chatterbox, Kirk Jerkum, and Roman. And huh? this Roman guy. And Ra and Randy already had issues with this Kirk guy with Kirk, the yeah. casino. You have actually Lang knows. Remember when they robbed me in a casino with that bullshit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That guy was a fucking, you know, fucking... fucking uh, weasels, bro, going through yeah, my weasel. shit. Yeah, weasel. It was a bozo. Bozo, weasel, everything under the sun. Fucking idiots. So Stupid now the question guy. is, do we wait for concrete proof or do we just get rid of all these motherfuckers? But now if we get rid of this Roman guy, will it stop production on the outside with the ketamine? Oh, don't worry about that. Oh, you're going to okay. handle it? Yeah, I'm already setting up a new pipeline from within and out of prison. Damn! You got the leaks, the plugs, okay. Yeah, I mean, I've been working to remove Roman for uh, for the past couple of days now, for being honest. Hold Coming on, gotta... or yeah, I'm almost there, Tony. I'm almost there. Where are you at? <laughs> I'm driving Sounds up like the highway. Randy. It literally sounds like Randy. <laughs> uh, the highway past pedal box. Good shit, good shit. What car are you driving? I'm driving my moped. What color is it? Orange. He, he knows, bro. Okay. <laughs> he's, he's probably got his shit pulled up. Wait, this I'll, be, I'll be right there. Club. About 10 more minutes. About 10 more minutes. I'm coming. 10, ten minutes. Hey boys, listen, I gotta go pick him up. He's freaking out. I'll be right back, alright? I'll be right back. All right. Yeah, do your thing, brother. Hey, Rami, Celtics going home, bitch. <laughs> uh, We're not going home tonight. <laughs> You're going home, Rami. Y'all choked two big ass games. Uh, I blame, blame Marcus Smart, man. Roman dead. I do honestly believe that Roman is doing some 10,000 IQ shit to set me up as his fall guy.
I guess it's just, it just doesn't make sense. Why is somebody who comes off as so seemingly smart and careful all of a sudden being so reckless and telling everybody about everything that he's been doing the past couple days? Da, 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 da. 